Hi, this is Barry, Kilo, Bravo 7 Kilo, and we're going to test some 2 meter antennas, and uh, we'll try them against each other and see how it goes. We're going to use uh, Glenn's Beacon up on Fairview Mountain. Okay, this is Glenn's Beacon up above Fairview, about 45 miles from here. This is my... Uh, 11 element loop fed array at about 40 feet. No preamp. The strongest signal that beacon's running about 100 watts into an omnidirectional horizontal. Actually, I think it's a, a, a multi polarized antenna. That's about S8, I guess. Okay, there's Glenn's beacon on the five element Yagi at about 25 feet. So it's running about an S3.5, S4. Tried to peak it up directional uh, on the azimuth. Low power. There's full power. Okay, here's the horizontal loop antenna. Single element loop antenna. About the same height. It would have been exactly the same height as the five element Yagi. Same feed line. And it looks like it's running well, interference, almost S3. So I found it to be slightly directional when I rotated it around, but not very much. There's probably a null there because the signal's not consistent. It's a little hard to get to the bottom of that. There's my very nice hourglass antenna on the same mast. Okay, let's see how it goes through the sequence. Basically, the hourglass is two phased loops. There we go. Now, well, not quite as good as the beam. About not much different than the loop. So, there you go.